Marion County just saw a big sweep with 39 arrests. Valerie Lyons joins us now from the newsroom with the details. Retail theft is the number one property crime in the country. Experts say shoplifters are caught only one in 48 times on average. But with this major sweep, law enforcement hopes to send a message. Walmart, Family Dollar, the corner gas station, each affected by a criminal epidemic plaguing the nation. Shoplifting. An industry group says there are 27 million shoplifters in the nation today, and only 10% of those in Florida are caught each year. In Marion County, they just rounded up 39 suspects in two days of work. Basically, we'll have what we call some takedown teams. They're partnered up in the parking lot. So we'll stage some detectives in the office with loss prevention. Walmart will have their loss prevention walking the floor of the stores. Of the 39 suspects caught and arrested, many were charged with additional felonies. A lot of it uh, secondary was drugs. Uh, we caught several with narcotics. Experts say discount stores and gas stations are often targeted, so customers are urged to report suspicious activity. One, use caution, and two, you know, just be aware of your surroundings, but for the most part, I would, you know, notify, um, you know, the store loss prevention and let, let them handle uh, what's going on. The sheriff's office conducted its first retail theft sting in 2015, and following the success of this one, it hopes to partner with other retailers in the future. Reporting from the UF Newsroom, Valerie Lyons, WUFT News.